everyone and uh, welcome to another episode of Let's Play Retro. Uh, today's game is Rough and Tumble for the Amiga. Again, another late Amiga game, um, which I never played back in the day. Uh, I had the Amiga for many years and um, I never played this game. You know, never came out when I was active on the Amiga scene. And um, so let's play it now. First time playing this game. Let's go right into it. World number one. I've heard good things about this game, man. And I, I remember seeing the uh, pictures of this game in the magazines. All right, so basically you have uh, Rough Rogers here. You run around with a machine gun shooting these baddies. Okay. Wow, the graphics are great. Sound effects, sound effects are good too. Okay. This is awesome, man. This is really good. Oh. Wow. Oh, I'm dead already. Jesus Christ. Come on, let's go. Well, at least uh, the enemies you already killed, they do not show up again when you die. You start at the beginning of the level, but they do not show up. Oh, that guy, you shoot that guy on the floor, it's pretty tricky. You know? Okay. My weapon got a little bit better now. Yeah. See on the top, top there you can see like uh, different weapons. I have three hearts, my energy. Hmm. There's all these collectibles we get, I don't know what they're for. Uh, one thing I realized, um, look at the floor, it has those little things where the robots appear. Yeah. Let they get dead, there are no, no more robots coming. Oh, jeez. Come on. Alright. Oh, that's, a, that's an exit for the level. Let's kill one more guy. Oh! Jesus Christ, come on, let's go. Okay, starting the level. Oh, everybody's dead. Okay, so let's go right to where I was. Cool. Yeah, I kind of like that, you know. You don't have to... Uh, you, just, you, just, you just need to kill the guys you haven't killed yet. That's pretty cool. I don't mind going back to the beginning of the level when that happens. Oh, there you go. Like coins, so you can buy stuff later, probably. One more heart. Oh, now I have four hearts. Okay, good. Level complete. Okay, the coins are bonuses. Okay, I killed 23 baddies. Let's go. Okay, more, more of the same. Okay, you see, you see the thing, little thing where the the little robots spawn. You see the there's a little uh, blue thing going up. You know they're making more robots. Yeah, look. There you go. When they exhaust the robots, then they stop. They get dark green. So keep that in mind when you're playing the game. Okay. Oh, these choppers. They're deadly. Okay. Come on, come on, chopper. There you go. Okay. Man, this is a really good platform again. Really good. I'm enjoying this. This is even I played Lionheart the other day. This is even better. It was pretty good, but this is much better. It's even better than Lionheart. Highly recommended. It. And it's this is exclusive to the Amiga as well. This did not come out anywhere else, and it was designed by some German coders too. You know, those Germans, like, when the Amiga was fading everywhere, like, it looks like it was flourishing in Germany, because so much great uh, Amiga software, late Amiga software, like from 1994 onwards, was uh, made in Germany. This game was made in Germany, and it's. Uh, I think it. I think it was made in Germany. Wunderkind is the name of the company that did this game. It has to be German. Um, 
But, um, like I was saying, like most of these uh, German titles are pretty good ones. They're, they're good at this thing, man. And they love the Amiga. Alright, got killed again. Oh, game over. Lord. Okay. Let's, uh, let's exit this. And let's try again. There you go. Uh, I'm a little bit more now. But I'm a little bit more prepared now. Okay. Yeah. Still, I did a stupid move like that. Okay, that little guy on the floor is dangerous. Okay. Let's shoot him. Alright. This game has so much collectibles, man. Imagine if those are loot boxes. <laughs> the little apple does. <clears throat> I wonder what each thing does. It didn't do anything for me. That apple. It's just stuff that looks pretty for you to collect. There's a cherry there. There's a candy. Uh, these things give you points, I guess. That's it. Dead already. Alright. Come on. Come on, rough and tumble. Red Rogers. He's in Red Rogers. No, they came out with a Red Rogers game um, for the PS4 recently. Yeah, it's. I saw the other day at GameStop. It's heavily inspired in this one. It's probably made by the same guys. I want to. I want to grab a copy of that. And. Um, even though we're a retro channel, but you know, I play everything, man. I play Xbox One, PS4. The only thing I don't have is the Nintendo Switch. Yeah, yeah, I don't have a Switch. Kill me. Uh, I don't know, I don't see... I don't see why the, the Switch is such a big deal. If I have a PS4, I don't think I need a Switch. I have a 3DS, which I love. And, uh, DS, 3DS, PSP, Vita. I don't, I don't need a Switch. I may sound stupid right now, but that's how I feel. Um, there you go, next stage, next level. Uh, I think I did a little bit better this time. Yeah, I killed last enemies though. All right, rough and ready. Look, the sounds of this game. See the. the the noise of the metal when you shoot the robots. Ding, 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 ding. This is pretty awesome. The explosion sounds are good. It's a, it's a very high polished game, man. Very good, very good. <clears throat> it does not have any parallax in the back, which which I thank these developers for. I don't like the parallax. Sometimes it makes me dizzy. And it's not well done. Uh, take that, guys. Take that, metal heads. Teen heads. Uh, jump. There you go. Oh, it was electronic bees. Okay. This should be. Should the beehive. More robots coming, Rogers. More robots coming. Oh, I like those sounds. Clang, 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 clang. Wow. Sometimes you have to get rid of like all of them, you know. And. Uh, some of those are coming back, you know, the first level, they do not come back, but at least some of the, the, the choppers are showing up again. The, the exit's right there, I cannot reach it, so I have to find another way. So, see, if I hold button, if I hold the button and I, I aim to the floor, 
you know, I, I can shoot diagonally down. Look. <clears throat> it's really cool. Like, you can shoot in many different ways. Very good. The characters are very well animated. You know, Red Rogers looks really cool. I wish... I wish people were talking more about this game, man. This is a classic. This is, this is an instant classic. Oh, little platform thing, little elevator thing. Oh, my gun now is a fire flamethrower. Flamethrower. Let's burn everybody. Well, level design is pretty, pretty interesting. You know, it, it, it. I don't know if you realize, but it does the same thing that. Uh, that uh, Turrican does, like when you go, when you go into the, um, when you go into the, um, to the bottom, like it gets darker, that's, that's a cool, uh, cool feature, yeah, I, yeah, people, you might be thinking, well, the door was, the exit was right there, no, it was not open, it was not open, I, I need to find a key or something. That's why I got back. Okay, let's get this. Okay, beware of the chopper. See, it gets a little darker when you go on the bottom. lights up a little bit when you go up. That's that's a cool touch man. Get the heart. Yeah. It's a really cool touch. I think I should get out of here. Oh too many robots man. Yeah, done. Those robots are done. Ah oh, yeah. One more shoot I'm done. If it's, uh, let's let's try to get to that door. I wonder if I have the keys already. <coughs> oh Jesus! Where is that again? Uh, maybe I should go all the way to the bottom. There's more stuff there that I haven't seen. Okay. See, got a little yellower. Man, ah, damn it! All right, zero lives. Okay, now I have a code here for uh, world number two. Let's try that. Let's try the world number two code. Jason Perkins and Robin Levy. Oh, those, those do not look like German names. Uh, they, they're probably British. I'll check that later. Okay, let's enter the passcode here. This will take me to the to the uh, world number two. Uh, let's take a look at world number two before I bail out on this uh, let's play. I already like what I saw, man. This game is, is on top of my Amiga list right now. Alright, world number two. We're in some caverns here. Oh, look at those little guys. The spinny guy. Oh, Jesus. They have different collectibles and gems. Look at the sound, man. Look at the soundtrack of this game. Jesus. This is really awesome. Oh, yeah, little crab guy shot me in the face. Okay, 
okay, let's grab, let's grab him. Uh, oh, how stupid I am. Clang, 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 boom. Alright, uh, done, crap guy. Okay. Oh, oh my god, robots. You see that the robot has like a, his bottom is like a tank or something? Man, oh. <clears throat> the developers are not, are not kidding when they said we, we want to make a hard game. The game is hard, but it's really enjoyable. I like this game. I'll try to post um, later on some long plays when I finish those games. You know, I'll try to finish those games. You know, I always found I don't know. If, I'm not a very good gamer. Let's let's put it like that. Let's be honest. <laughs> I'm not a very good gamer. But I will I will try to uh, finish some of these games and do like long plays. But I don't want to I don't want to cheat. I've seen some of those uh, Amiga long plays, MSX long plays, uh, SNES. No, the guys they use cheats so they they don't die. I don't like that. No. I want, I want to do like, you know, the little, uh, that guy from uh, Cinemassacre, Mike Matei. Yeah, I want to do just like him. You know, he gets a game, he plays for four hours, and uh, he doesn't care, man. He's a, he's a pretty good player. That guy's a player. That guy knows how to play video games. And, uh, but he finished the games. Uh, I want to, I want to do something like that. Uh, where I played the game on this entirety. Right now, my last plays are just gonna be a couple stages, you know, 20 minutes, 15, 20 minutes stops, you know, maybe a little bit more if the game is interesting or if it's a game I really love. Uh, like when I'm soccer, I did the other day. Um, I played like five levels, so that, that went on for like 40 minutes or so. Yeah. Then something like that that I really like and I don't care. I don't care if people are gonna watch. <laughs> to be honest, I'll, I'll play for longer. You know, if you wanna stick to, with me and uh, watch watch me play, I appreciate it. If you, it's fine if you don't want it to. I I really don't care. You know? This channel was designed so I can share my love of games. That's it. And I'm loving this game, man. This is really, really cool game. Oh, look at that. It got, it got darker, and the rocks got darker. There's no sunlight on these rocks. Okay, what should I do? Should I should I jump in the water? Maybe it's like Lionheart. If I hit the water, I'll drown? I don't know. Okay, no. Let's... Let's not hit the water. Let's go back and see if there's anything else I left uh, behind. I'm, I'm missing here. Uh, no way I can get a big champ. It's just uh, decoration. Okay. It's kind of hard to go back. Uh. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Uh. Yeah, no, you can't go back. Let's draw. Ah, look, you can swim. You see, Red Rogers, <laughs> he's, he's holding the air. <laughs> um, wow, cool, cool underwater level. Yeah, unrealistic though. <laughs> if he was a real kid, he would be dead by now. Um, well, not that I will not die anytime soon, because the first time I go here, I don't know what to do. Oh yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. Yeah. Game over. Let's try this level one more time. Let's try one more time. I think I can do slightly better if I try one more time. It's the uh, same thing all with all these games, man. You know, the more you play, the uh, longer you go, farther you go on levels. Let's uh, let's go it again. Rocks and stuff. World number two. 
rough and ready. Okay. Hmm. See, that was a heart there that I haven't seen the other time. Uh, then again, every time you play, you play better. Yeah. And I definitely want to play this game a lot more times. I want to play a lot of this game, man. Not gonna do it today, though. Not gonna, not gonna bore you with my uh, my rough and tumble playing. But I definitely want to play this game in its entirety. This is a pretty good game. I also, uh, I'll try to get a hold of a copy of that uh, PS4 version. I saw when it came out, and uh, I haven't seen any more again. I need this game stop. Yeah, but with the pandemic and everything, I haven't, I haven't been to GameStop. I haven't, I haven't been anywhere, really. And this thing passes. Oh, let's play games. I have a ton I can play, I don't need to buy that now. You see, I have to collect keys to open those two doors. I have the keys already. No, I don't. Alright. Let's try to find those keys. Oh, there you go. Blue and red. Got them. And you see all those enemies, they, they pretty much jump at you. That, that guy moves fast. You know, this little twirly guy. Looks like a screw. Yeah. No, the soundtrack is amazing this game man. I want the soundtrack. I'll look for it. I wanna use the soundtrack of this game on my channel man. <laughs> I'll look for it. This is really awesome. Rough and double for you man. See you can jump and shoot shoot on the back. How cool is that? Let's go to the back. Back to the back. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. The character animations are really nice. Okay. The games like this show what the Amiga could do. The Amiga, could, I, I, I still believe the Amiga could do a lot better than the. The N64, the, not the N64, the Super Nintendo and the Sega Genesis. I always thought the Amiga was underused. You know, the Amiga could do a lot better than those systems. That's that's my personal opinion. Games like this show it. And when you see conversions, Amiga conversions for those systems, they always look so poor. They don't look, they don't look good. All right, let's let's focus here. A lot of people shooting at me under the sea. Under the sea. Alright. Okay, good. Destroyed. Let's try to destroy this guy. He keeps shooting things at me. Okay, let's move. Hold. Hold button. Shoot. Uh, I, I cannot do that all the time. Uh oh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get killed here, man. Okay. Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, one more life. Let's go. Yeah, okay, rough and ready. Okay. Oh, there's coins there. And heart. Hearts are always good. Always collect hearts in video games. If you see a heart, get it. Alright. Deadly fish. I wish I could... I'll try to take this thing down. It's, it's annoying. Let's see if I can take it down. Ah! Damn! Alright, one more try. Okay. A little P. With this point. Okay, let's go. Let's go down to the... Water to the water. Okay. All right. To the Bryans. 
to the metallic pariahs. Okay, let's, let's just go. Let's, let's, just, let's just run a gun here. Oh, see, I can shoot, I can shoot diagonally to the bottom. Not all the time, though. I don't know if it's my controller, but... I wish I could destroy these things. Yeah, there you go. Killed. Let's have to kill this one. Let's have to kill this one, because I'm stubborn. There you go. Oh. Done. Yeah. Let's go. Collectibles. Like loot boxes. You see the one I destroyed before? It's it's still destroyed. So that's that's the cool thing about this game. Oh man. Got hit. I'm dead. Alright folks. That's rough and tumble for you. Really enjoyed this one. Really enjoyed this one. Recommended uh, five stars. Okay. Alright guys. Thank you for watching. Talk to you later. Bye bye.